Hey there, welcome back. I am Jenny Hendricks. Thanks for joining me. I have a super fun place to show you today. Stick with me. We are going to explore Three Peaks Recreation Area. Hey there, welcome back. I'm so glad you're here. I wish I had smell-o-vision. It smells so good out here. It's just a little bit of sage in the air, a little bit of the juniper pine. This is gonna be a really, really fun video today. I'm really excited to bring it to you. We are going to explore Three Peaks Recreation Area. It is a partnership between Iron County and the BLM. It was sort of the brainchild of a county commissioner many, many years ago named Lois Bullock. She's a dear friend and has done so much for this community. And so she was the one that really got this thing rolling. This is a really incredible place. There is so much to do and it's something that as a community we are awfully proud of. So let's take a look at what we have out here. So this is about 6,500 acres. This is a big place. It's about 10 miles northwest of Cedar City and it is open year round. So there's so many things to do out here. Let me give you the lowdown. First of all, you can see all of these cool rocks. This was mostly formed by volcanic activity. This is kind of fun because disc golf is really becoming popular across the country. And out here at Three Peaks, there are two disc golf courses. Super fun. And the terrain that you are running over is really incredible. The scenery is really, really beautiful. Out here at Three Peaks, there's over 27 miles of mountain biking terrain. You could do this little practice loop before you take off on all the really super gnarly mountain biking terrain that is out here. It's really cool. Okay, another thing that this area is really sort of known for is our OHV trails. So if you've got an ATV, if you've got a side-by-side, -side, if you've got a four-wheeler, this area out here is just so much fun to take those ATVs and off-highway vehicles miles and miles and miles of terrain to explore and is absolutely beautiful. Over 42 miles of OHV routes with a wide range of terrain and varying ranges of difficulty on those as well. There's also 155 acres here that is fenced off where off highway vehicles are not allowed to go. So it's just for hiking, uh, mountain biking, things that are not motorized, so you don't have that uh, conflict sometimes that happens between motorized vehicles and human-powered vehicles. So that's something that was really well thought out in this area. One of my favorite things out here is they have rock crawling events. If you have never been to a rock crawling event, it is so much fun. All of these cool tricked out Jeeps and vehicles and Broncos and just cool vehicles that have been really tricked out, really souped up, and they are just crawling at the lowest speed they possibly can over all of this really cool terrain out here. It is really fun. So if you get the opportunity to come out and see a rock crawl, that is a real highlight. It is really, really fun. There's a developed campground and there are uh, pavilions for picnicking. So you can come out here and camp. You can bring your RV, you can bring a tent. You could come out for the day and uh, bring a picnic and eat in the shade of these really cool pavilions. And one thing that I really like about Three Peaks is you can bring your dogs. So not all of the parks are dog friendly, but Three Peaks is one where you can bring your pets. We've also talked a little bit about uh, dark sky, designated dark sky areas in this community. Now, Three Peaks isn't designated as a dark sky area, but sometimes some of the dark sky areas that are designated are hard to access in the wintertime because the roads are closed because of snow. If you can't access some of those designated dark sky areas, this area for stargazing is still really, really incredible. 
for all of my folks who are coming from big cities, if you haven't been out to a rural area at night, looking up at the stars, you have got to put that on your list. Come out here at nighttime, look up at the stars. It will blow your mind. No question, it is gonna blow your mind. Absolutely beautiful, incredible stargazing out here. There's horseback riding. For all of my equestrian peeps, you can bring your horses out here. There's a, an equestrian staging area, so you can drop your trailer and take off. And there's just miles and miles and miles of really cool terrain to ride your horses. One of my favorite places to visit out here is the shooting range. The Iron County Shooting Range is out here at Three Peaks, and it is a really well-developed range. They've got a pistol range, they've got rifle ranges, they have restrooms so you can come out here for the whole day, bring some snacks. It's really a cool place to come out and shoot stuff. Now, for those of you who dig the RC world, there is an RC airplane flying field and runway and there's also an RC car track. So how cool is that? I mean, this is really an area that has got something for everyone if you like the outdoors. Shooting, horseback riding, ATVing, RC planes, RC cars, mountain biking. It's all right here at Three Peaks Recreation Area. I hope that you will put this on your list. It is really worth a trip out here. It's a very cool area. Again, we're really proud of it. I am Jenny Hendricks. Thanks so much for joining me. We'll see you soon.